Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft Edge has received an update, which rolled out late on Friday last week in my part of the world on the 24th of May. And if you have been using Microsoft Edge over the weekend um, on a regular basis, I'm sure that by now you would have received this update. But because we are dealing with an important security fix, it's always good to double check that your browser is up to date. And after this update has been applied, the browser is sitting on version 125.0.2535.67. And that point release has been bumped up from 0.51. Now, um, this is not just a security update. And first of all, Microsoft says they have fixed various bugs and performance issues. And they seem to push those bug and performance uh, fixes out with every point release um, uh, almost on a weekly basis. And the big one here is that um, there is an exploit in the wild, a zero day, that's been patched. And that's the security fix that rolled out for the Chromium-based web browsers last week where um, the update to the stable channel contains a fix for CVE 20245274, which has been reported by the Chromium team as having an exploit in the wild. So a zero-day exploited in the wild means it's an exploit that's out there, current and happening. So very important to just check your browsers up to date. And it's a high severity vulnerability, which is type confusion in V8, which is the V8 JavaScript engine, which is part and parcel of the open source Chromium project and the Chromium based web browsers. So a very important security fix rolling out for Microsoft Edge. And then over and above uh, the bug and performance fixes and the security fix that's rolled out, um, they've also improved the reliability with this update according to Microsoft where they fixed a browser crash and or hang which occurred when trying to select from a drop-down list with a large number of options. So that's quite an important fix that's rolled out because I always say on the channel that if a crash is addressed in an OS or a browser, that's always an important fix in my opinion. So they've improved the reliability with this update as well. And then there's also an announcement. Um, if you are finding yourself uh, in an enterprise environment, and I'm just going to mention this. The announcement is Microsoft Defender Application Guard Extension Deprecation. And Microsoft mentions that because Application Guard is deprecated, there won't be a migration to Edge Manifest V3. The corresponding extensions and associated Windows Store app will not be available after May 2024. This affects, they say, the following browsers, Application Guard Extension uh, in Chrome and Application Guard extension in Firefox. That's just an announcement as well. And over and above that, I uh, haven't noticed any front-facing features or tweaks and adjustments that have rolled out um, with this latest point release update. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.